هنرسم ولادهم بيلعبوا على شط البحر ومبسوطين انه هالايام انه صار في سلام بمساعدة اليونيفيل والجيش اللبناني. We are drawing about peace. We have this draw here. We draw so many arrows to explain the idea that peace comes from us to all over the world, then it comes right to us again. I want to ask you a question. What do you have for children of Lebanon to say in this special day, World Peace Day? What can I say? that you are the future of the peace. This place is fantastic, it's beautiful. It is one of the most beautiful places I've seen in the world. I've traveled a lot, I've been in several places. And uh, Lebanon, uh, and the uh, beach in Lebanon, the uh, countryside in Lebanon is fantastic. And uh, peace today is enjoyable, thanks to your uh, capability to uh, deal with peace. But in particular, let me say that you are the future for the peace in this world. No, it's lovely. Now to see the kids here trying to focus on peace, trying to think of what they're getting out of it. And I love the way that, that some of the children talk, talk, spoke about sending messages out because they come back. That's one of the strongest messages we can make on, on today, at the International Day of Peace. I am much honored to host this celebration at UNIFIL headquarters. This year, the theme for International Peace Day is the right of the peoples to peace. Peace and security are essential foundations for social progress and the sustainable development. I am sure that many of you here today suffered the losses because of war and experienced difficult times. And you hope in your heart this will never happen again. And uh, I have invited you today because we all share the same aspiration for peace and determination to prevent Lebanon from being again engulfed in a war and destruction. I want to mention in particular the sacrifice of the Lebanese armed forces and the security forces which have lost many brave men while defending their country.